Oh, and the company has said their concern is for the seven workers who were injured. Yeah, for all of us, in fact. CBS 42 News reporter Brittany Bivens continues our coverage. She's been following the conditions of those injured. She's live at UAB, where some of them are being treated at this hour. Brittany? Yeah, that's right, Jim. I just talked to a hospital spokesman and he told me there are four people right now being treated at UAB. We are still working right now to get more information on exactly what their conditions are tonight. And as you said, we have been out here at UAB monitoring things throughout the afternoon. And we did see a lot of activity, especially with the helicopters passing overhead. We also did see an ambulance here. And we are being told by spokespeople that this is a level one trauma center so that some of the more serious patients may have been taken here. But Shelby Baptist also said earlier tonight that they were taking care of about six or seven patients who had more minor injuries from the explosion. We are told that a majority of the people receiving treatment today are people who are actually working on that pipeline. So that's what we know right now. We are going to be continuing to keep an update on these victims and on their conditions and bring that to you just as soon as we get it. Tonight, live from UAB, Brittany Bevin, CBS 42 News.